right, Nitwittians, we are doing this Legion T5 and we are blasting through a ton of graphics cards. We got the 1070 Ti right here and we have uh, our 1660 Super, which is a stock graphics card that comes with this big black bad mamma jam of awesomeness of a PC. And our stock score with this guy was 6,122. Uh, 6, and our GPU graphics score number one was 37.85 and our second graphics score was 33.67. All right, guys, we are gonna get this guy upgraded, get this guy popped in, and we are gonna run a benchmark and show you what uh, the difference between the 1070 Ti is versus 1660 Super. Uh, let me get things popped off and then we'll go from there. All right, Nitwittians, we are gonna get started with this and we are gonna get our PC powered down and then we are gonna go ahead and start unplugging everything, get our network cable, our HDMI, and our power cable. Set that off the side because we'll need that for when we boot her back up. Uh, our two thumb screws right here, we're gonna undo and then pull back and our case is undone. Set that off the side because we don't need it right now. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pull the power cable right here and wiggle and jiggle. She's on out. And then snap our, our lot latch right here. And then we're gonna get our uh, number two Phillips and we're gonna get our two screws done right here. Go ahead and pull our graphics card out, kind of wiggle and jiggle, and our 1660 Super is out. Grab our PMY 1070 Ti. Go ahead and latch that in there. Make sure our power is plugged in. This has the tab on the top. You know, if you guys have this availability and you can get one of these, uh, as long as they're not too beat up, I don't think you'll be able to find one used or find one new, but you'll be able to find one used. Um, what I would do is if you do get a used one is as soon as you get it, get it in your PC and I would run some, I'd probably run like 60 or seven. I'd get 3D Mark Time Spy, sorry. I'd go get um, 3D Mark down, downloaded and installed and paid for it because it can test the card. It's only like 20, 30 bucks. And then I'd run the stress test on the GPU. Make sure it doesn't have any artification, any artifacting or stuff like that. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and plug everything back in and I'll bring you back for the results with the benchmark. Hey, Nitwittians, we got the results with this 1070 Ti and we scored 6,872. And that's a graphic score of 42.80. And then our second graphic score was 38.66. So you're only gonna gain about 10 frames per second, maybe 12 frames per second if you do wanna get a 1070 Ti. You could stick a 1080 in here and that'd be kind of a gain if you, wanna, if you do wanna source one of those, but really there's newer graphics cards that are more available than this and you know you're gonna get it new and it's not gonna be someone's beat up used old junk. Not that old graphics cards are junk, just technology is so brittle and finicky. I would say go with something new. But if you're, if you're wondering if this will work, this, this, you know, here's the video for you guys. But anyways, this was a Tech Knitwit uh, video and a Tech Knitwit Productions. And I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And this is Tech Knitwit, and I'm out, y'all.